Walking Champions, the greatest show on earth, featuring current top stars direct from New York's Madison Square Garden and Chicago's International Amphitheater, produced by Sports Publicity Institute. Hi, Bill Cardill at ringside. We have a great card tonight from Marigold Arena, the wrestling center of the world. Right now, here is your ring announcer, Leonard Sterling, to introduce the first spot. Ladies and gentlemen, these wrestling exhibitions are sanctioned by the National Wrestling Alliance. Your promoter is Fred Kohler. They're supervised by the State Athletic Commission. Your officials this evening, the attending physician, Dr. Serafin, Dominguez, your timekeeper, Bob Klaus, your referee, Frank Alice. One fall, 30 minute time limit. In this corner, weighing 232 pounds, from Antioch, Illinois, Johnny Case. In this corner, weighing 275 pounds, from Benton Harbor, Michigan, Bobo Brazil. Stay with us. We'll be back in a moment. Is my mic closed? Referee Frank Alice going over the rules. Against rugged competitor Johnny Case, real ring veteran Bobo Brazil. The fans are clamoring for action. And they're going to get it. Timekeeper Bob Klaus says, let's wrestle. It's the first of five bouts on wrestling champions. Johnny Case working over Bobo Brazil. front face lock. Trouble with that, you can go from the offense to the defense and just a flip of the body. Case now moving to the attack. The side head lock, lock and a few hard rights. Now along the rope. Brazil and Case really going at it above the microphone here. Referee Frank Alice trying to break them up. Nice hip roll by Case, head scissors by Brazil, now the advantage. A hard hold to break. If you were Case, how would you get out?
case close to the ropes he might maneuver that way. Case working over to the lower rope. Frank Alice says, let him go, Bobo. It's just that Bobo doesn't trust Case. Bobo all it over. I'm wise to you, Case. doing a little sighing on the left arm of Case. One time great Jim McMillan, great University of Illinois football star. Todd Case, a lot of the fine points of wrestling, and Case will have to call on all of them to get out of this hammerlock. Good tight camera shot showing the reaction of Johnny Case as Bobo Brazil applies the pressure. Case trying for the rope. Will he or won't he? Playing horseshoes, it would count. Case <laughs> almost. <laughs> he didn't. Case inching his way over to the lower rope. Maybe he'll make it this time. Pressure with a hammerlock to the left arm and holding the right arm back. Case managing now to get his head under the rope. There you see the grimacing Johnny Case. Determination, sheer moxie did it. Case managed to work his way under the rope. Referee Frank Alice said break the hold. Case expounded a lot of strength there. Take a little time perhaps to make a recovery. His left arm is probably numb from the hammerlock. Case starts off kicking.
into the abdominal stretch. Running the ropes. Oh! There we go again. Case trying to work his way over to the ropes. Pressure being applied with the Cobra stretch or abdominal stretch either way. Brazil gets his hand raised in victory by referee Frank Alice. Case, wait a minute. Case, a little bewildered. He's protesting. He's claiming his foot was over the lower rope. A rhubarb on our hands. Kay says, no, my foot was out of the rope. I didn't submit. But referee Frank Allen says, that's it. To make it official, let's go up into the ring and our ring announcer. The time was five minutes. The abdominal stretch. The winner of the fall, Bobo Brazil. We'll be back with Danny Ferraza and the Mongol. Don't go away. Hey.